What's going on everybody? It's your boy back with another dash video. And I'll be reacting to One Division Season 1 Episode 2. Now, where we were at last time. Uh it was basically a Dig Van Dyke show wrapped up with a Bewitch show. <laughs> and it was very interesting. I see where people uh, from what I've read online from different, different people's reactions to this show, uh, well, at least the first two episodes, um, they're kind of, uh, like a lot of people are perplexed. Like they don't, they like, they don't know what to make of it. They're like, wait, what, what is this? <laughs> like, what is going on? Cause it's so different than what Marvel has done before. And you know I like it. Now different doesn't always necessarily mean better or good or whatever, but it's different. And I will give it a chance. I like. I actually liked the first episode. It was very. Now it's probably I probably liked it a little bit more because it it tickled my nostalgia bone, which is something Disney is very good. <laughs> Disney is very. Good. I mean, they pretty much launched Disney Plus, banking on people's nostalgia. And it shot up to for what, like the second or third, like uh, streaming service, you know, the top three streaming services. So, hey, nostalgia, nostalgia's a bitch. But yeah, it made me feel that, like thinking back to when I was young, watching, you know, black and white TV shows, reruns. Obviously, I'm not that old. I got one foot in the grave, not two. Uh, <laughs> But, well, yeah, but anyway, I said I don't want to talk a whole lot for it because I mean, these episodes are actually pretty short. That was one thing I was surprised about because this one's a little bit long. The other one was like 26 minutes, it's 33 minutes. But it seemed like these episodes are going to probably stay around the 30 minute mark. It might be a little less, a little more, but definitely stay around there. But anyway. Here we go. What was that? That's one thing in TV shows like that. Uh, when I when I was a kid, I was like, "Why husband and wife sleeping in separate beds in the same room?" I was like, "I mean, I know on TV they don't want to even hint that these married people are having sex." Oh, my love, I see nothing amiss. You have absolutely no reason to be. No. You were saying? Wait. Oh, yeah, that's right. I have superhuman strength. And I can go intangible. That's right. <laughs> one of us should really determine the source of that sound. Yes, one of us should. I'm like, oh, uh, you more powerful than me. You go do it. <laughs> this dick just a viper. Ladies and gentlemen. For my final trick, I bring you what year the was, cabinet uh, of mysteries. Bewitched, huh? Because I'm trying to think, is this was the first episode more like a 50s show? And this is more like a 60s show? Because like, I watched these shows in the 90s. I don't remember exactly when those shows aired. Okay, first episode was September 17, 1964. Last was March 25th, 1972. As normal as possible while doing so. Well, I don't think that should be a problem. <laughs> this is our home now. I want us to fit in. Oh, darling, we do. We shall. Oh, yeah, I think he does have that dream. He does have it. I mean, of course, it's not the Mind Stone. But we gotta, you gotta keep the, the, the laser beam that he can shoot at us here. It's up to snuff. That's a swell idea. You tell those tree branches who's boss. Would you look at us? Wonder and vision, Westview veterinaries. <laughs> I'll see you at curtain call. Is this like Shield trying to like get in there or something? Is she like? Is it like a, like she blocked off like a piece of land or something? Is she just just reforming? To what she wants it to be. Yeah, it's a helicopter. 
So. Robot? I mean, uh, not robot, uh, remote helicopter. Say, those pants are peachy key. Do you really think so? The other ladies are in skirts. I was worried. We only have a few hours until showtime, so a little less cross chatter and a little more focus. Okay. Those little boys and Bitch. girls are. Right. Seem like more like stroking your ego. I know these are indeed grave matters. A new business actually means another round of Danish. <laughs> Raspberry? Or cheese fill. Oh, neither for me, thank you. I don't eat food. <laughs> I too have some top secret gossip to share. Norm, here's a communist. <laughs> right. It definitely wouldn't have been left. Okay, I didn't think he's joking. Serious. <laughs> <laughs> he's funny. All right, so. I can. Then how would you do that? <clears throat> I've heard things about you. You and your husband. Careful, well, bitch. Well, I don't know what... I think she walked up, she's like, I don't know what you've been told. I assure you, I don't mean anyone any harm. I don't believe you. So you know I could throw you in outer space with my mind, right? Wanda. Wanda. Who's doing this to you, Wanda? Wanda. She like snap her neck like they do us. Uh, supernatural. <laughs> Dottie! Uh, uh, Special lady. <laughs> Accessory. And his strucker. Oh my. It is fascinating just looking at Strucker. Old shit. He'll make so, time for you. The old, like, commercials, old, like, public announcements. <laughs> it is like, wow. I'm sure people look at they back then they look at us they think like it's just foreign as they live through both. Listen, something strange happened with Dottie. Well, something strange happened before that too. It's hard to explain. I was just playing with his shoes. What is going on? You are. <gasps> Surprised no one asked him like, what kind of name is Vision? He could say is is Vision. He's French or something. Like, like the fuck? <laughs> I'm like, uh. Huh. See there? He's using a rope. I'm like, where did that come from? That wasn't there. <laughs> They're like, oh, for a second, I thought he was flying. Well, uh... <laughs> oh, she. <laughs> Out of my ass. I did not think he was gonna say that. <laughs> I'm doing it. Uh -huh. I'd be like, <laughs> this witchcraft? I was like, oh, somebody like had like a, a noose. <laughs> he was like, oh, I thought this was witchcraft. <laughs> Somebody got a, a fire <laughs> ready to burn him in state. Would you look at that? That really gummed up the works, didn't it? Mm. I'm in a dark cubby hole. How'd you do it? Oh, a magician never reveals his secrets. He leaves that to his assistant. And she's not talking. I had a feeling you'd say that. <laughs> I'd be like, no, I want to know, like, motherfucker, you, like, teleported me. Like, what the hell happened? Wait a minute, you just walking there with, with his skin off? 
I wish she actually wore like rubber mask or whatever like they do in Mission Impossible. It's like he had to like rip it off. <laughs> Just add a, a little horror to this. What? How the fuck you get pregnant? Who you been fucking? This is really happening. Like no, I'm a fucking yes. android. Why? Oh, okay, I was like, you just walking outside? But like, you shouldn't even show your regular face in a doorway so people can see you. Is it, is it Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? What the fuck going on? It's B Man, Ant Man's cousin. No. She's like, no, and just rewind. Oh, we're getting colorized. I guess we're moving to the 70s. The next episode. Everything is fucking wood panel. <laughs> that Kyle Reese? It sound like Kyle Reese's voice. I could definitely see why people would be confused by this because it's like, oh, you, they still going with the whole sitcom thing. But like I said, from the, the trailers, I assumed that that was kind of how it was going to be. Maybe with some things happening in an episode and then they jump into another you know, decade or something like that. But I figured I, I did assume I should say that it was going to be centered more around uh, a sitcom uh, like what's the word I'm looking for like a, a sitcom like story beats I guess you could say but uh, I'm still curious like what is going on like is this a it, it doesn't seem like it's a pocket dimension is it seems more like Wanda is in an area on Earth and she is manipulating the reality in this area, probably no bigger than the supposed town they live in. She could be in a, in a like an abandoned town or something. Uh, what was that abandoned town? Was that in an Incredible Hulk or was that in Hulk? I think that was in Hulk, and I think that was like a like uh, um, like a weapon testing ground, huh? but uh, like I'm a, like I want I want to know if it's like if she's just in an area and she's manipulating the reality in that one area, and then you get she, sword, I guess, because they they sew that sword, and I, I don't I didn't look at the the uh, I guess the uh. Um, What's the word I'm looking for? I can't I can't think of words today. <laughs> the insignia of sword. Like like shield. Like I can't think of insignia, but I'm it looked like sword. So I'm assuming that's what it is. And it's Marvel, so they probably in they probably alright, we've kind of ran shield into the ground. <laughs> like like let's do something else. Plus shield is no more, right? Like I don't remember them building it back up. I don't know. I don't think they mentioned it in that five years since when Ultron, uh, not Ultron, uh, Thanos snapped. So I know it was like a five years. I don't know if they build Shield back up, but they didn't. I don't think they mentioned it. But <sighs> shit. But maybe they like okay. Let's give Shield a break. Right? They had their own TV show and everything, so let's go and let's do something else. Let's use they got they got aim. Uh, sword, sword, and like I said, sword and shield are like the good guys. Aim is like an evil organization. Uh, I almost said that. Well, they, they, I guess now they can use it 
whenever they decide to incorporate into the universe the uh, was the Brotherhood uh, Brotherhood of Mutants is that the name of it? I, for some reason I want to say the Brotherhood of Bad Mutants <laughs> but I don't think Magneto would name his group that because <laughs> he does of course he doesn't think he's bad but uh what's another one from Marvel I almost said the Legion of Doom I was like oh wait that's DC um, now I'm forgetting DC's like agencies that they have I don't think DC really like plays on it I mean, they had the Justice League and the Legion of Doom and they're like we don't really need they got, well, they got the, the Lantern Corps uh, what else they got and of course, I mean, they had, uh, the Teen Titans. Um, and they got the teens, but I'm, I'm talking about like organizations. Like, Justice League have, like, especially you've seen Justice League on, like, pretty much an organization. Like, hundreds of heroes under one banner. But, uh, well, like, Legion of Doom, uh, hundreds of villains on one banner. Oh, you would think what they show only like a dozen <laughs> it's like oh we only show the most important no one cares about it. Like, <laughs> but uh I'm I'm digging this I'm digging the I'm digging the show I'm, I like being I like things being mysterious them slowly building and I mean you know it's gonna be some because it, especially like with Wanda and they seem to be awakening her other abilities that she showed in the comics, uh, I don't think she's gonna be anywhere near as powerful. I, they, well, I shouldn't say never, uh, which I didn't until just then, but uh, I don't, they might do since they get the mutants now, they might do a house of M thing. I don't know, that, that, I think that's way down the line because that, that was that's a whole like reality warping thing, like that shit. In the comics, it still felt <laughs> after she did that, and then she re reversed it somewhat, and that shit still felt like through uh, that whole continuity in the comic book. So that that's something that that's like really big, and you got to introduce all those characters, and then then do the house because you can't just jump in, like it's like you jump into that'd be like Morrow bringing debut in the mutants and the first movie or even the second one is house of them like <laughs> it's like, it's like uh no i like that i think this is a bit early for that that'd be like if they did iron man and then the next movie was the avengers like <laughs> wait what like i th i mean they i guess they could have did that but the Captain America wouldn't make sense though. Natasha, she could have taken it. Okay, we know what this is Natasha on, but Captain just showing up and like, oh well, we just assume that. Yeah, no, 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 yeah. The way Marvel did it, they couldn't just you couldn't just jump into the Avengers. You they would you had to do like they had to do backstories for at least some of those. Like they own movies or they had like Natasha. You know, there wasn't a backstory, but you knew, but they introduced her in Iron Man too. So you knew who she was for people who didn't already know. Uh, and then they introduced, uh, Hawk, Hawk, I almost said Hawk man, <laughs> Hawkeye and, uh, Thor. So yeah, the way they did, they had to do that. I mean, I'm like, they could have done it. You could have, you could have just, they could have started with the first Avengers. But I think that movie would have been trying to flush out some people's backstories and stuff. At least someone like Captain America. Uh, it would have been weird. It, 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 I think it would have been a lot. So maybe the best way is to just do a bunch of movies, additional movies. Like, hey, this is that person's origin. This is that person's origin. And then bring them together. But I'm not a writer. So I'm sure a writer could figure it out and just do it. That's like I've seen people say, you could have just started with Justice League. 
You know, you ain't have to do all these. Because I know a lot of people, well, each individual, each individual need to have their own story. Specifically, Superman, Batman, and Wonder Woman. Because they, you know, the trinity. But I've seen other people make arguments. And even some, like, stories, like, they kind of looked at the comic books and said, well, you could have just started with it, Justice League. You didn't need to uh, do individual movies. And, like I said, that could have worked. You know, it's like, you get a writer to write it in, and, uh, because they kind of did that with, kind of, if you look at, like, the Justice League cartoon that would came around in the, in, uh, the early aughts and early 2000s um, they just started with them well, it started with Batman and then they kind of went into oh well we need to help each other to stop this alien invasion and then everybody started coming in but it was no one had their own like origin story all these people all these heroes already existed and they're not coming off of, uh, you know, they technically not coming off of like something else. Like that Batman and that cartoon was technically not supposed to be Batman from the anime series, or that Superman wasn't supposed to be Superman from the anime series. As far as I know, I don't think it was any ties to that. But um, they seem to be just well, we heroes and our own doing our own thing. Now this threat has come that we. We fight. We fight together because we can handle. We need each other to handle it, and they decided to stay together for threats that that what they would all have to band together again. So that well, we shouldn't just go out of some way there and wait for something to happen. We need to train together, get to know each other, stuff like that. So you you could have done it, and then those and then those shows, the episode they kind of branch off, and then you'll see. Wonder Woman and Hawk Girl together in one episode doing something, or the Flash and the Green Lantern, and then and you get to see the stories like dealing with maybe Green Lantern's backstory, or, or the Flash's backstory, or Batman's backstory, or Superman's backstory in those episodes rather than doing starting individual episodes. <laughs> like I said, that was a TV show. It's easy to flush that out than in a movie. But anyway. Hope you enjoyed my reaction. One well, if you did, make sure to hit that thumbs up button down below. Make sure to subscribe and you here hit that bell. You'll be notified when I upload new videos. Comment down below. Share this video. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.